ramionami z pleceni Ciało blisko ciała wokół ognia skupieni Dyskusję do rana zasypiam pod nachem z gwiazd Oparci o siebie, o siebie niespokojni, niespokojni O ziemię, o siebie niespokojni, niespokojni O ziemię Anna, his federation from Poland, which is uh, just starting uh, its own anti-nuclear campaign uh, because of the uh, nuclear program which is carried out in our country by, by the government. Uh, before we start, I'd like to pass some handouts. Uh, you can just, you know, share them. Yeah, so it's like take one and, and keep the uh, They consist of the basic facts concerning uh, the nuclear program and uh, Proposals from the government and, uh, and the protests we are organizing. So yeah, hopefully you will find uh, uh, most of the information is there. I'm not gonna pass all of them again because uh, just doesn't make sense. It's all there. Uh, so uh, uh, basically, what, what is not there uh, and what is needed is uh, some sort of introduction to Polish politics because it's quite different from the Western Europe. And uh, as well, it, it doesn't involve like, our campaign and the protest against the nuclear power and the, and the whole issue. So, uh, uh, basically, although the political system in Poland changes uh, 22 years ago from a sort of uh, state capitalist authoritarian regime to a liberal democracy, uh, the way the country is running and the policy is running is still pretty much authoritarian, which means. Uh, Amongst the politicians, there is a strong tradition of uh, avoiding public consultation and the public discussions on major issues. And uh, most of the political discussions uh, focus on either ideological or uh, historical or personal issues. It's, there's not much discussion in the public sphere uh, directly on, on the meritoric, current, issues. current meritoric issues that concerns the, the way the country is running. Uh, just as well, we don't have much mechanism of uh, public uh, involvement in decision making. Like uh, there is no, we don't have uh, too many uh, really really strong uh, NGOs or channels of communication between the, the public and the government uh, or the forums for such a discussion. Theoretically, under the obligations from the EU, obviously there is a there is a need of uh, public consultation of all major decisions, but. Uh, it's just, it's mostly on paper terms, in practical terms. The society doesn't have much influence on the day-to-day -day politics. Uh, can I add one thing? Uh, I would like to add also that uh, the level of awareness in the society is also very low. Uh, it's that society uh, believes in what the government say. They, well, of course, they criticize the, the government uh, that is, uh, well, it depends on the political views of various people. Uh, but basically, especially the influential group of uh, educated people, uh, quite wealthy, like middle class, uh, is like uh, not in opposition to the government, and they are more like trusting in the politics of the government. So they are hardly ever opposed. Uh, yeah, as, as, as I mentioned, there is a. Uh there is not much tradition of uh, uh, public dissent or uh, public opposition to the government plans. The basic rule is uh, basically after the election the government do what it wants and the people uh, either agree or disagree, but even if they doesn't agree they don't have uh, much chance of you know, influence uh, in the way the politics is run. Uh, it changes a bit in, in the recent years uh, since uh, the development of like proper middle class. The, the people with uh, a strong financial financial position, uh, which uh, I guess, uh, which I guess uh, are trying to uh, get a similar political position as well. Which means, obviously, once uh, once the, they got middle class consciousness about uh, how strong they are and how influenced they are, uh, they used to didn't bother with politics at all. Now they are starting to. Uh, they are starting to be more politically involved, although it's 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 the uh, very beginning of this process and it's, it doesn't it doesn't have any more concrete or practical forms. It's more a consciousness that there's something wrong, something is wrong, and the politicians have uh, too much authority and uh, uh, it's 
not right not to have this sort of public discussion and public consultation of, of, on major issues? Actually, it, uh, it is more about uh, the fact that uh, if they are active, they are active only because their group of interests is endangered. It's, uh, it's like they don't have an overall perspective that uh, the authoritarian uh, politics of, of the government uh, is uh, harmful to everyone, uh, but they only react uh, when their interests are endangered. Like uh, they are, for instance, a kind of minorities, or they are uh, they have any other problems like uh, like with health or anything. Uh, they react and they associate when uh, when their group of interests is in